Hey guys, Brony General here, back with another video, and today I'm here to do an actual full video on my Panasonic BTS901Y color video monitor. Now this monitor was made in 1999, no, 98, this, this, actually pretty old uh, CRT for a PVM, but it was made in 1998, and it is a 9-inch PVM color monitor. Now, as you can see, it's fairly small. I mean, I can put my hand over the entire screen. But it is actually currently being used as a bedroom TV here. I'll take this picture off of it just so I can demonstrate everything. But if we look in the back here, we have the, all the um, regular information that you get with these things. Uh, you see, you see, BTS91Y. Uh, oh. Damn it. Manufacture date here. I'll try and pull it. Ah! It's kind of stuck in its little hole here. But made in March 1998, as you can see, it uses two types of connections. Or three, I guess. S Video, these, if I can take one of these off, BNC, which I, as you can see, have adapted to composite video and for the audio it uses by default standard composite audio you can also change the refresh or no the um, this the impedance from 75 ohms to high Z whatever that means it just makes the picture brighter so I just keep it on high Z and keep the brightness down so I have a little more leverage as you can probably tell the cabinet is all metal it is magnetically shielded, oh. and this little 9-inch color monitor weighs more than a 19-inch computer monitor. I joke not, I mean, that glass is ridiculously thick. Why, I don't really know. It's like these things were preparing for war, but they're very well built. Now... You turn it on here, or actually, let me show you the front controls real quick. You have lines A and B because it does have two B and C videos. Uh, you have this thing, which kind of I don't know exactly what it does, but it screws with the horizontal hold. You have this one, which screws with the horizontal and vertical hold to where I guess if you have a four split B and C connector plugged into here, it will display them like camera here, camera here, camera here, camera here. So that sets that. And then this one, I have no idea why it exists, but it turns the whole screen blue. It, I guess, turns off the green and red guns, so you only have blue, which is weird. And then it has the uh, sync, so you can change it from internal to external. So that's cool. And if you stick a little pin in there, you can change the aperture. So let's turn it on here. It does have a speaker, and you can change the volume by uh, turning this forward and back. It's also the power. Now, I can't really show much more than this image on the screen because I am currently watching the My Little Pony movie on it and I haven't finished the movie yet. So, well, I mean, I've finished the movie pro previously, but I, I want to finish it again on here, so I don't want to pl be playing it, you know, and end up skipping a part. But you can tell just by this, color accuracy is spot on. Clearness, spot on. I mean... Yeah, I can't really do much with the camera because I have to have the flashlight on here. I'll, I guess I can uh, try to cover it up like that. But you can tell this thing is just dead sharp. And very clear. Very bright, too. And the brightness is not all the way up. It is actually all the way down. So if I turn the brightness all the way up, whoop, it doesn't actually do that much. But. Who are you talking to? I'm making a video. Oh, okay. Uh, it also has tint and color, vertical hold, so I can go like... But, yeah, uh, as far as this thing goes, it is probably the clearest, brightest, sharpest, most vibrant-looking CRT I've ever seen. So basically the most vibrant-looking display I've ever seen. When displaying, like, nature scenes or any sort of, of, of really high-color contrast video it looks insane 
Like, the, the amount of, of color depth that these PVMs have is crazy. And to think that, I mean, this is low end compared to some PVMs. This is only a 480i one, but 480i is fine when you have color accuracy like that. Like, to put it into perspective here, I'll turn it back on. I can be laying over here, this far away from the TV set, and I can zoom in for you guys. I can still see that perfectly without glasses. Perfectly. That's how sharp it is. So to say the least, yeah, it, it it's great. It's great. But that's all I have to say about this Panasonic PVM, this BT-S901Y color video monitor. It is a very nice color monitor, and hopefully I get a lot of use out of it. Oh, yeah. And it th I think it goes without saying, the picture tube is basically new old stock. Why? I don't know. There's also paint on it for some reason. Again, don't know.